Hello, friends. Welcome to the video. Okay, what are we doing today, Scrimple? Health and wellness update. Yeah. So first of all, big disclaimer, I have been, um, there you go, bitch, doing hard manual labor all day today. Not really, but I've been uh, helping my grandparents move or organize their house. I went to bed at 3 a.m. last night. I took a three hour nap when I got home. So I am like, like, look at me. I am living my best life, look amazing. Um, so all that to say, I need a video for tomorrow and we've been meaning to film this health update video for forever. So, um, did you think Pippa just tripped like five times? And we got 12% battery on the camera, so we're gonna So this will be a run. speedy one, you guys, um, cause I'm so tired and the dogs are antsy and I gotta edit this and get it out tomorrow. So there you go, the glamor behind YouTube. <laughs> so how have you been doing, honey? Um, I've been doing really good. So I feel like we've been on a super great kick. Mm -hmm. We have been doing so much eating and cooking at home. And by yep. we, I mean, exclusively Eric. You've been doing a lot of eating at home. I've been doing a lot of eating at home. Eric's been doing a lot of cooking. Um, he has been taking advantage of the nice weather and really smoking all kinds of meat. Protein is up. Um, he's just like become a grilling master, like connoisseur. So it's been really nice to have really good, hearty, good quality meals at home. We've just been doing a meat, for protein and then a vegetable side. So we've got a really good like cauliflower recipe that's so yummy and we do potatoes and broccoli. And so it's just a very nice like routine that we've established of making sure we have a big serving of protein and yep. then a little vegetable on the side. And that's what we do for dinner pretty much every night. Yep. Um, we've gone out basically hardly at all to yep. eat. Um, we went out for our anniversary. That was for our anniversary, uh-huh. Um, our six year wedding anniversary, which was May 21st. Color. But like I've been doing um, smoothies for lunch that I have concocted. So I do, um, you can get packets of unsweetened acai for like acai bowls and whatnot. Acai. Acai. Acai berry. Uh, so I put a packet of that. You can just get them at Target, your local grocery store. Just make sure to look for the um, unsweetened, the Sweetened has lots of sugar in it, um, but the unsweetened has no sugar in it. So you do a pack of what? No, added sugar. No, it has zero sugar oh, in great. it. Um, so you do a packet of that, and then I do um, this strawberry banana orange juice, just like a little dash of that from Trader Joe's, a banana, a couple of handfuls of frozen strawberries, and some Greek yogurt. And that has been like an amazing, delicious smoothie. You know how when you make smoothies at home, they're just never as good as a smoothie you can get out? This smoothie that I have concocted is like so good. I drink it every day, I love it, it's very delish. And then I'll have like a pr light protein snack on the side, like some nuts or something like that. But I feel like we've just been in a really great routine. Yeah. Um, now, and there are many instances where like for example, we just celebrated my grandpa's birthday with them in Tulsa and had a really great day spending time with them. And I ate freaking cake and ice cream because it was my grandpa's birthday and I wanted cake and ice cream. So you did too. Oh. <laughs> so we're just kind of very content living our normal lives and making healthy choices. And um, we've been doing some really good exercise things as well. I feel like I'm talking this whole time. So why don't we I literally just said that. I'm like, I wonder what I'm gonna get to talk in the video. <laughs> why don't we move it over and you can talk about the exercise that we've been doing and anything else you wanna add. And also we're at 8%, so hurry. Oh, I know. I've, I've been doing <laughs> guys, this video. Welcome to just a very, like, very <laughs> casual chat with us. Uh, so yeah, I have gotten back Also, into... I'm wearing my dream sickle outfit. I'm talking now. Go ahead. Um, I've gotten back into using the tempo and the peloton consistently and I feel like I've hit a good rhythm uh, with them. That's been going really well. Uh, most days and the past month, today is the last day? Next to last Neither day? Neither one of us have. I think this um, is the last day of May. Nope. nope. No, tomorrow's the last day of May. Uh, but uh, our goal for the month was to do a 5k every day uh, during the month of May. 5k a day in May. Yep. Um, and I, I've hit that goal thus far, unless something happens tomorrow. 
um, whether it's the Peloton or us going on a walk or yeah, we spread it out lots of different kind of ways. Um, we went to the zoo one day. Yep. We've explored some different parks in the area. Hop on our bikes, hop on the Peloton or the yep. treadmill, like knock it out in a bunch of different ways. When I was in New York, I went to the gym with Tatum, and yep. um, so uh, lots of variety of five k. Yeah, activities. and you'll hop on the treadmill if we're yep. not going out anywhere. Um, I made it, I think, twenty or twenty-one days. Okay. I kind of fell off the bandwagon because mm, no reason, just kind of honestly forgot about it until we started talking about it just now. And I realized I haven't done my 5k in like <laughs> a week, but I definitely made it 21 days. Um, well, and it was funny cause when you reached, like I was literally on a plane about to fly back from a work <laughs> trip and Miley texted me, he's like, Hey, do you want to do this? And I just immediately went, yeah, that sounds great. Because I had already resolved like coming back from Dallas that I was going to start doing the Peloton again. I was like, Oh, your elbow's cutting into me really bad. Oh, it'll take 10 minutes to do it on the Peloton. And we would go on walks together to do it. And that would take like an, an hour. hour. <laughs> um, so there were some days where it was like... <clears throat> so I feel like you have done it every single day faithfully. But I feel like time in, time out, I've done cumulatively more time. Work smarter, not harder. I, I'm just saying, like, I'm trying to make myself feel yeah, better yeah, yeah. for my... 5k a day for 21 days in May. Um, so, <laughs> but even still, it was such a good experiment. Yeah. We had such a great time doing it. I felt great about myself. Like, and I feel like it really helped in propelling me to know, like, okay, I can do more than a mile. Like, yeah. I could go three miles. I could go more than three miles if I wanted. So it was just a really great like way to reintroduce exercise in a kind of hardcore way. Yeah, it was really good quality time. Yeah. And it's like, what else are you going to do? Like, you can't just go <laughs> to another room to, like, watch TV or something. Like, you're walking for an hour. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, it was good quality time to talk through stuff and things like that. So, uh, but, yeah, I feel like we're both in a good place. One other thing that I've started doing um, is tracking my calories with my fitness pal. Not with the intention of restricting myself, just logging. And, you know, I've, I've modified some decisions based on the information I had where That's it's good. like... It's 10 o'clock at night. I'm a little peckish <laughs> and where I normally would like, oh, I'll have an apple a or a peanut butter sandwich. sandwich. Uh, it's like, well, I could do that, but that's going to be for the like the sandwich thing, like 200 calories this late at night. Maybe not. That's so, not the smartest decision. Uh, yeah. So yeah, that's been really good also. And just for an update for those who care, weight disclaimer, we're going to discuss our weight right now. So if you don't want to hear about that then we'll see in the next video yep. this is the last thing we're going to talk about but um so yeah we have we have both lost some weight yep. and you know i'm not super concerned about that being super hardcore about losing as much weight as possible like i'm just more concerned and happy about the like as cliche lifestyle changes that yeah. we've made that really have been super sustainable i mean we've been doing this for months now at this point yeah um, so I've lost about 10 pounds, give or take. I'm down about 12 yeah. at this point. So doing um, good. But it, it fluctuates for me because also I'm doing a lot of really heavy lifting. And so, you know, mm -hmm. growing muscle, losing yeah. fat. Yeah. So. And one more thing I will say on my most recent trip to New York, I did a lot of shopping, like a lot. I'll link it up here if you like a good shopping vlog and haul vlog because, ooh, we did some damage. Um, but I had an amazing time. And I talk about this in the vlog too. Um, shopping and just kind of letting all these rules that I've held myself to because of my weight um, fly out the window of what I can and can't buy. So like, I love dresses. I Like a casual dress just to throw on. I have not bought or worn just a casual dress that wasn't like, I specifically need something for a fancy occasion or event. Yeah in years you guys because i just thought like oh that's not gonna look good on my body um shorts are the same way like it's freaking hot already in oklahoma and i just like don't wear shorts because i don't you know feel comfortable wearing them in my body but i just had the most like transformative sounds dramatic but transformative yeah. experience shopping it was so positive and wonderful to find all these fabulous dresses that are so cute and i feel great in to find shorts like it was just a really nice like body positive experience that I wasn't super like intentional about trying to be more body positive or anything. It just kind of happened and it was just really nice. We are just on a great trajectory and 
it's making some real changes in our life and we're just feeling great. So cameras at 1%. We got to go. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe and Smash like this it. video. Bottom line, we're doing great. So hope you guys are too. Let us know down below. Bye.